Hello, okay, here's a topic for a video. Uh, light, what effect does light have on your body and on the human, on, hum, on people? I used to think that light really didn't make a difference. I used to sleep in, I used to work always with the windows closed. But what I started to realize is that I, I saw some research uh, from a podcast I was listening to and what the guy was saying is that you know obviously all the all the energy in our planet comes from the Sun ultimately but the way I used to think it worked is plants have something called photosynthesis and they get the energy from the Sun that we eat the plants and that's how it works but no there's 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 evidence that shows we our skin and our especially our eyes um, have a lot of sensors that can absorb energy from light from photons and it, it, it causes all sorts of signals to, um, you know, signals in your body and circadian rhythms. And it goes to the point of, like, basically the practice is that you should go to bed when it's dark. And before it's dark, you shouldn't be looking at any, any blue light. Like, blue light comes from the screen. Blue light is what the, you see in the morning. The sky is blue in the morning. It's red at night um, due to the you know, the shifts, the, the spectrum of light that we see from the sun. So you're supposed to get a range of exposure to a range of different types of light. Natural light is the best uh, throughout the day. And you should wake up when the sun rises, go to sleep when it's dark and not have like TV screens and all this stuff in front of you. So I've been trying to do it. I try to get like right now I'm working with no shirt on in direct sunlight. And I notice that even with the baby, even with myself, it makes a huge difference. You I'm shocked. I never thought that it would. And I know people like, uh, it was almost like to me, have you ever heard of those people who they think you don't have to eat? That they, 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 There's people out there that believe you don't have to eat, that they're going to live off of light. That's retarded. Like to me, that was just, you're an idiot if you think this. But turns out, obviously you can't, you still have to eat. You can't get enough energy from just light. But there is energy emitted and sensors in your body that sense light. And it makes a difference. So... Um, I'd be curious to see what you guys think and try it out. Try and pay attention to it. In the morning, you need to get exposure to light um, and pay attention to what it feels like. Like First thing when I wake up in the morning, I try to go outside and stand in direct sunlight or even if it's not like the sun is not rising, just it's that blue sky. Just look at the blue sky directly outside. They're saying even windows. Um, even windows, they don't filter visible light that we can see, but they filter light that's that we can't see. And it's best if you're not in front of a window, if you're not filtered by anything, if you just stand directly and look at the sky, you will feel it. It's like, holy, it's like having 10 coffees. Like you start waking up immediately. And, uh, you know, there's studies that mix it to the cold as well. So I noticed when it's cold, it's a stronger feeling. And uh, you know what? Something I'm just starting to experiment with, but... I like to know what you guys think. Does light matter? And um, what do you think about these circadian rhythms? See ya.